do a free roam of Milesville. We don't need to do the little the day tour. So we are walking within Shadow Man's hallway right now. We're down here in the right is where the famous Shadow Man picture was taken. I personally have investigated before here and uh, captured an EVP that was intelligent in this exact hallway. Whenever I was uh, with here with another investigator, and that was back in uh, 2012, I believe it was. The cafeteria area is where I captured that face in the window. Mm -hmm. yeah, well, right down here is where the famous Shadow Man figure was captured in the doorway leaning out. Yeah, he was leaning out. Stand up. down here. Like, I know I'm not the tallest person in the world, but I mean, that thing is like uh, yeah. the original Shadow Man picture. And it's like way up there at the top of the door almost. Right. This is tall. So, right through here, I have a picture of a face in the window. And I'm going to walk over toward this <coughs> window right here. It's the third window in on this side. Right here, this third window in. I actually have a picture. There's a face outlined right in here. Oh no, I, I always found this place right I here in the cafeteria. Too. Right. Very, very creepy. Right. I did too. You figure a lot of inmates congregated here. Mm hmm They weren't really under as strict supervision. Well, you know, it was just eating time. Oh no, you want to do so I feel like some stuff, yeah. Want to do spare box? Yeah, we can do a spare box. Spare box full of charge and ready to go. <clears throat> Let me see how this lights up this whole room. Oh my god, yeah. Yeah, I've always felt really weird every time I've been here in the cafeteria. This area feels really weird. Is there any spirits here who are still serving their sentence here? We go to the place and you can have a The lights flicker. Mm -hmm. The lights flicker. Mm -hmm. Are you trying to use our energy? You like that big bright light? Mm -hmm. Do you remember Stephen and I being here before? This is our first time here together. But we've both been here before. Can you tell me what other investigator was with me in here? Let me stick this over here on this. There we go. That's better. What can you say one of our names? Do you remember either of us? My name is Steve and I come here with all respect. My name is Mark. We just came here to listen to whatever you have to say to us, try to communicate with you. Is there a man that hides in the kitchen area? Danny, are you in here? Yeah, when I investigated here, we had the whole place to ourselves. We got a lot of communication with Danny. He has screenings up in the uh, hallway by the infirmary. Mm -hmm. Danny, can you hear my voice? Danny, are you upstairs in the infirmary still? Do we have to go up there? Is 
Is there something you want to tell us? I killed? You killed? Who did you kill? Is that why you went back here? Did you kill? Are you sorry for what you did or are you glad that you did it? Yes. Want that? Want that? Are you sorry for what you did? Are you okay with what you did? What you did was it justified? Did that person deserve to die in your own mind frame at that time? Danny, is that your face that I shot the picture of? Is that you? If this isn't Danny, can you tell us your name? We don't want to call you by the wrong name. What is it? What is it? I said whatever. What's your name? You come here to talk to me. Are you aggravated that we're here? Are we invading your space? I did it. I did it. Sound like the same voice you said I killed. I killed. Does anybody in here remember Harry Howard? Does anybody remember R.D. Wall? Yes, sir. Oh, yes, you had that. What about Red Snyder? Do you remember R.D. Wall? What year did you come here? Can you tell us what year? This place was open for over a hundred years. Were you sent to death there? Well, the crime you committed was so bad that they had a hang you out in the wagon wheel. Were you here during the riot? I hear something? I thought I heard a little captain. Is somebody in the kitchen area already open? We have a complaint from the school with a black box and kill people for us. So let us know that you're here with us. Or I have a black box in my hand and you can see the green dot and come back like down. Did you have a favorite food that they served here in the cafeteria? Or was it all bad? No. So the food was bad here? Did you trade your food for protection to know we were hurt you? Tell us your name. Can you tell us your name? 
Now I understand in prison, a lot of times people were called by their last name. Can you tell us your last name? How were the least conditions in this prison? Oh, it's been horrible. Were the conditions that horrible? Why do you stay here? Are you forced to stay here to serve out your sentence? Yeah, I've always felt weird here. Yes. Always. This is very uh, fully even investigating that one. Did you have to protect yourself when somebody steals your food here? Did you kill somebody? Can you tell us who the figure is that is known as the Shadow Man? It looks like he was leaving the cafeteria whenever that photo was taken. Mike. Mike. Mike, what was his, Mike's last name? Mike, are you in the shadow figure? the shadow man? Mike, why were you in here? What crime did you commit? Did you commit a homicide? Okay. So you did commit a homicide. Who did you kill? It's like three words together. I thought I heard don't help. Yeah. That's exactly what I was going for too. Well, you can tell us because this place has been closed and you're still here. Yeah, you were already convicted. Nothing else more could happen to you. Do it. I was there a fist fight? Yeah, I heard fist fight. Fist fight. Did you kill somebody in a fist fight? Was it an accidental homicide? I thought she was rolling the bar. Dude, it said it. It said fist fight. Did you have to fist fight somebody in the past area to protect yourself? Or did you fish by somebody who you actually killed them and don't put it there? Maybe night. Maybe night? That's a knockout. That's a knockout punch. Yeah, night night. Did you make him go night night forever? Was there a fish right here, or was it somewhere else? I would imagine fish right here, because what else did they have? Was there a fish fight during the ride? Did you kill somebody in here? Did you kill another prisoner? That you had a beef with? Did you kill a guard? We head down to the sugar shack. Crazy, yeah, we're getting a lot of. We're gonna head down to the sugar shack. Is anybody gonna be down there? Before we leave, can you tell us your name, please? For Steven and Mark. We're not here to judge you whatsoever. We're not. We came here with the utmost respect. We understand that sometimes stuff happens in life and you have to take matters into your own hands. 
Is that what happened? I mean, this was prison. It was every man for himself. We appreciate your responses to us. Thank you for talking to us a little bit. We're going to head down to the Sugar Shack. You can follow us if you want. Do you want us to come back up here later? If so, can you tell us? Feel free to follow us as we roam around tonight. We got this door. Yeah. So we're even a fist fight here in the cafeteria. It got out of hand. Yeah, I think we got this door. That goes out. Yeah. The sugar shack. I think the sugar shack was that in the courtyard. It's out around the other way. The other way. Okay. I haven't been there so long. All right. We'll be back later on. Hopefully. Thank you. We got this way. We yeah, got to go up here. This goes up to the stairs. Uh, <laughs> this is the cell right here. Yeah, this is a cell block. Man, do I got a weird feeling. I know, I got a really weird feeling. Are you following us? Like I said, we don't really judge it. We understand this is prison. I had uncles that were in prison. They told me some really awful stories and stuff that happened in here. Inmates getting killed. So I know how it is, and I really don't place any judgment on any anybody who was here or what was done here. In prison, you don't you live to survive. That's all you do. You had to defend yourself. We completely understand what you had to go through. Yeah, we're not here to judge you at all. You can tell us whatever you need to say. Stephen and I are not snitches. Can you make a bank for us? We're here by ourselves. Yeah. We're here by ourselves. Can you make a noise for us? We're the only ones here with you. No, that was down here on the cell block. Because we're next to Red Cell. We were next to Red Cell. Red Cell's right down here. Red, was that you? Oh, uh, we're definitely investigating Red Cell right now. Yeah. Dude, I got chills so bad. Yeah. Like I said, we're not here to judge anybody. We're just here to communicate with you. I think, which one was this cell? Oh, what was that? It's on the water. It's so dark. Which one? I know you're coming through this gate. Red cell is like right here. Right here. here we go. Very in brotherhood. Yeah. I'm going to put my rim pod in. In here, for some cat toys. Yeah. Red Snyder. This was your cell here. I know you probably get a thousand questions from people coming here. So I'm going to ask one that I don't think a lot of people ask. 
Are you tired of people coming in here and asking questions? So, oh man, it's so, I can't imagine living there. They were in there, what, like 22 hours a day, something like that? Yeah. At least. <laughs> can't believe going off still. Did it settle down or not? Yeah, it settled. Thank you, Red. Do you want to tell us something? We have quite a few devices in there you can touch. You can touch them some more if you want. Pardon my uh, shuffling around here. Can we turn this light down? You like it a little better dark? It's crazy how dark it is down here. I mean, we're what, like at least an hour away from sunset? And yeah. It's still this dark in here. Why do they stick you down here in this corner in the darkness? Were you that bad of a person? I don't remember the full story. Did he turn his back on the Aryan Brotherhood? What's that? <laughs> Did he turn his back on the Aryan Brotherhood? Yeah, he got stabbed in there. Right. Stabbed by, uh, Why did you turn your back on your on your brothers? This was the enemy that was just down, just down a few cells down from here. Hmm. Put the music box on top of the sink. Okay. Mm -hmm. My bottle. Oh. It sounded like it was right on the stairs here. Red, we come here with all respect to you. We just wanted to talk to you for a little bit. We're not here to judge you. You can touch those devices that we have on your bunk or on the sink or on the toilet. You can make them go off for us and let us know that you're still here with us. Can you do that for me, please? We would appreciate it very much. Are you in charge here, Red? I hear you were a pretty powerful man whenever you stayed here. As far as the inmates go. Yeah, nobody wanted to mess with you. But what made, what made you turn your back on your own brothers? That's what I want to find out. What happened in the end, Red? Can you tell us? Were you stabbed here? Who is the person that was caught on fire? I don't think that was where he was stabbed. I know Red was stabbed, yeah. but there was a person caught on fire here too. Right. Were you stabbed by somebody that you trusted, that you never suspected? Did you die an awful death from the stab wounds?
Now, I'm not going to lie. We're not okay with that. We're not okay with the fact that somebody you trusted turned around and did that to you. We realize that. Can you give us a sign to let us know that you're still here with us? You want me to turn this light completely off and be pitch dark back here? I could do that for you. That's crazy how dark it is already. That's what we're looking at right now. That's how dark it is back here in this corner. Like I said, an hour from sunset. That was reality for these guys here. Do you like this a little better in a pitch dark? We'll sit here and talk to you for a little bit if that's what you want. Some new voices, some new faces that ain't going to judge you for what you did or what what happened to you. Is the tour down here? I swear I just heard a voice. I thought I heard a voice too. I don't think we're in earshot of the tour. Jason! Yeah, no, I heard a voice too. Brad, was that your voice? Did you move out of your cell and walk down the down the range? Is that door slamming? Yeah, what is that? All right, that was that. You didn't hear that? No, I'm hearing it. Hello? I'm All right. There's a device on your sink, Red. If you step in front of it, it plays music. You probably haven't heard music in a long time. Can you do that for us? It's right above your toilet, right on the sink. I step in the cell and the room plus starts going crazy. Stay in the morning, stay back. You want us to stay out? You don't have to. Yeah. I'm putting my hand in the door and it's going off. Red, you want us to leave? Red, if you want us to leave, make them glow. One more time, look, watch. No, he's not doing it. That's the same exact thing you did. Is it because I came forward? I can step back. Maybe he just wants to talk to you. <laughs> Was it Mark? Do you want us to leave? Do you want us to leave this area? If you want us to leave, touch them all. You don't have to worry, Red. Steven and I both are not See, now, now I'm inside. Nothing. Hmm. Red, do I remind you of somebody? Do I have that look about me? You know what? Well, I don't mean to sound weird. What's the Aryan Brotherhood? German? I'm German, but I'm not part of the Aryan Brotherhood, though. Is that why you like talking to 
and Stephen. Do you think we relate just because we're German? Stephen and I were cool with everybody, every nationality. Mm -hmm. I hate nobody. No race, no creed, no nationality. Nobody gets no hate from me. Are you okay with that? No, we understand that's how you had to survive in prison. Joining up in groups like that. You, we've used the REM pod thousands of times. It does not react that far away. Unless there's some way of conducting no. all the way through the metal of the bed. Mm -mm. Um, my phone lights outside the... Yeah, no, it's not going off with you in it. That's good enough, but yeah, that makes no sense. Hold are this. You, hold, hold, hold the camera. I want to go in. Are you just talking to Steven? There you go. Nothing. Bro, that makes no sense. See? It's, it's like. Game. I got nothing. Thank you for communicating with us, Red. I'm going to step back here, see if it happens again. It seems to be more connected to you. Mm -mm. Look. I'm doing the same thing with my hand, with the light and everything. Does Steven remind you of an inmate that was here? Do you feel threatened by me? Does it remind you of one of your friends that was in here? See, nothing. That's weird. We're trying to debunk it as we're going. Yeah. And but I mean it was it that happened what? How many times consecutively? As soon as you went in there. See? Nothing. Hey, let me step back here again. Because I was way down here when it went off. Trying to replicate the exact environment. See, Mark's down there. He's walking down the range. All right, Mark, you can probably turn around. Nothing. Nothing. That's crazy. That's unexplainable. Thank you, Red, for listening to us and talking to us and letting us know that you're still here in your cell. We're going to leave this area right now. We, we got very few time. We got a little bit of time to be here. Do you, so want, do you want Steven to come back down here by himself? If you want me to come back in here by myself, turn that back on again for me. Touch it. And I'll come talk to you again. I can't help but feel like it's some kind of connection with you. We're just trying to communicate with you somehow. See, same thing. Um, yeah. Yeah, we've replicated it how many times and it's not going to right. completely debunked. Or debunked that it's us just touching this corner and we know how REM, we all know how REM pods work you got right, right you got on it. you got to be right up on the antenna yeah, this isn't a k2 meter where it can be you know manipulated by cell service you know cell phones or something like that right like you got to be right up on that thank you red we appreciate your hospitality but we're going to take out we're going to take off and we're going to go journey some more and go talk to some more of your friends or whoever that's still roaming these ranges and these these halls let me grab this drive out here real quick. You know what? Do we want to do one more thing before we leave? What's that? I have the voice recorder going. Mm -hmm. I don't know if we'll have time to do a uh, live playback, but we could also always just do an EVP session and see what we capture later on, even. Because mm -hmm. I know we're kind of time constrained here. Thank you, Red, for communicating. We visited here before. Mm -hmm. I don't know. I want to cover as much area as we can. 
Right, I do too. You got this way to go to the Sugar Shack, right? Uh, Sugar Shack is down the hall. It's actually right outside of the uh, where we first came in. Let's try to get there before they get there. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. That's crazy. That rim pod should have never went off. No. Like I said, we've used the rim pod how many times? You can be right up on it when you go off. Right. That makes no sense. I didn't even set my rim pod up. I got a rim pod here too. Yeah. So. We, can set, we can set them off in the sugar shack. Exactly. Because that's a pretty big area down there. Sugar shack or infirmary? Oh, infirmary. Yeah, let's go to the infirmary. I'm trying to remember how to get there. I know how to get there. You gotta go back out to the Shadow Man hallway and go upstairs. That's right. Yeah. But I heard that voice down the hallway. And it sounded like there was door slamming. Nobody down here. I went down there, there's nobody down here. There was a full, at least like three words from a, a, a man's voice said something for like three words at least. Almost a full sentence down here. Red, you cannot follow us down this hallway. You gotta stay here. <laughs> you just hear something behind you? No. I did. This place is amazing. Yeah. Like, I got chills just everywhere, dude. Yeah. And it's cool in here. It is, yeah. I'm kind of glad I brought my hoodie. Yeah. No, I'm, I'm just running on energy. Adrenaline when you get an activity like this. Uh, what's that? What did I just see from there? What are you talking about? I just saw a shadow straight ahead with somebody peeking around the corner. I had my bottle in my mouth because I was trying to put my backpack back up. Camera on, so. That's so dark in here, even more in the daytime. I mean, these walls are just built with thick concrete. There's no insulation in them. Dude. Oh, this the room. What room? I can't go in here. What's wrong? I can't go in here. Okay. Why what's up with this room? Do you like some of here? Yeah. Really? Yeah. Okay. Dude, because we was down here, and I walked in here, I was like, "Oh, I can't be in this. I can't be in this park." Okay, stay back, stay back. I just want to see. It's an investigator report. Because usually we go along Shadow Man Hallway. Right. That's why this long stretch is Shadow Man Hallway, right along this wall. No. They were way too far away. Uh, can you hold this real quick? I gotta throw my backpack over my other shoulder. Yeah, I'll carry it for a little bit. Oh, God. Do you need your phone charged? What's that? Do you need me to get that battery pack out? Your phone? No, no, no. Not yet. Okay. I got this baby gap backpack on. There we go. We'll show ourselves every once in a while. <laughs> there we go. Yeah, Jason hooked us up. Yeah. That was a good love shot. Yeah. Oh, those mannequins over there. Mannequins. Dude, they, they the get Indians. me every time. Yeah. The Native American. The Adina Indians. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, this place never gets all like this. Wow. Look how dark it is in here. Yep, this is their wall that goes up. Hold on, let me turn my light on. There we go. Did you hear that? It was like. <sighs> no. That wasn't me exhaling, was it? Oh. It could have been. 
I don't like it in there. I don't know why. That's the old guard tower, or guard watch tower there. Yeah. The there. Or the prison cells. It was like. <sighs> Could have been you. Dude, I'm not going to lie. For everybody who's. Here's the infirmary right here. I remember just because we had a rock thrown at us up here. Because we were set up right here on this. And. One of the craziest things I've ever had happen to me. We um, was doing a spirit box session up here. And I was like, You want to do harm to us? We heard a big wow. tension. And I looked down, there's a rock this size. Right next to my foot. You know, I'm standing right here. My brother, my ex brother in law, had that happen on the shoulder shack. We were down there, he was waiting by the entrance. Mm hmm. I was like, keep us aside. You know, keep us aside. If you get make a noise, we'll leave. There was this piece of metal hit the post down there. He was right by it, freaked out. You want to stay up here and conduct something? I'm going to go down there in the hallway. Is that You want to go down there first? Yeah. All right. I always had a weird feeling that I'm about with this. Uh, and I'm sure I'm all this stuff down here. Because this piece of the actual fish burn is the uh, burn. Right. Even be up here, still not that. kind of a return to like one of the first crazy paranormal experiences that I personally have ever had. And where this happened was literally, I'm getting chills right now thinking of it. Yeah. Right here, what we just passed through. Mm -hmm. Right here. It was right here. And I'm getting that same weird feeling right now. Like you stand where you are. Okay. Okay. When we were here in uh, July of 2011, my sister-in-law, who I think is pretty sensitive to stuff, started feeling really like we were the first hour. We were all just happy. Oh, let's, you know, excited and anticipating ghost hunting, touristy. Like we walked up here, she started getting really uneasy. Like something was following her. Yeah. And uh, she bolted down here. She could not stay in here anymore. You so wanna? I, I went running after her, mm -hmm. and right here, right here, about from where you're standing, you mm -hmm. know, Brian. Yeah. Has uh, has investigated sometimes with me because that's you know I first started really investigating about where you're standing right now. Mm -hmm. I was right here. I felt something touch me on the back. Oh damn! A physical hand touched me on the back. You wanna? I'm set up a rim pod on each end of the hallway. Throw some cat toys in the middle. Yeah. Let's do that. Like I've always, this infirmary has always been, like this is up there with one of my- You gonna stick your room pod down here? Yeah, this is up there with one of my absolute, most active places I've ever been investigating. Is right here. It's so awesome to be back here. Okay, beginning at infirmary recording in the hallway. Here you go, stick one. It just feels weird right here. And we were doing a spirit box session up here as well. And there's the paintings up here of Danny, who was one of the inmates. We kept getting responses to Danny, but we did not think of Danny's existence. Right. And then we went downstairs and seen that he was one of the one who painted all these. Danny Lane, right there. And if you want to see the room pod down here, by this? Yeah. We go one each in the hallway up. These are all Danny Lane. He's the one that, uh, Danny Lane, can you hear? Us, can you hear our voices? We're looking at your paintings right now on the wall. You did a pretty damn good job, if I don't say so myself.
we got this whole hallway lined with devices that you touch and have them go off. Hmm. Maybe take your music box on the way. Yeah. You have cat's voice already. Right. Mm hmm. I got to pay two meters too. I got phones up on the window ledges. Right. Hmm. Researchers gets a chance to investigate here. Go for it. Can't believe how dark. I think they're coming off. Hmm. Any patients that's up here in the infirmary want to talk to us, feel free to do so. We set some equipment or some devices or some toys on the hallway floor. One plays music and the others play just regular noise. You can walk in front of them, touch them. Do whatever you feel like you need to do with them. Can you show yourself to us? We come here to respect you. We just want to see if you still roam these halls. Can you make a noise? Can you make a sound? Can you shut a door? Can you do something for us? What was that? Did you hear that voice? Yes. Sounds like somebody yelled. Can you talk to us again, please? Now, I know prisons were not quiet places. There was always yelling going on. Who just yelled for us? Do you need help? Do you need some medical attention?
you here. Hello? There was somebody walking. Can you walk towards us? That was somebody walking. That was boot steps. Hello? That was an actual footstep. Somebody back here? This hallway is active. Do you remember being here? Do you remember me being here before? I felt your hand touch my back. One of the craziest things I've ever experienced. And it was right here. Are you getting more attention? You might as well come out and communicate with us because I know you're here. I have absolutely no questions. I know we go places investigating, questioning if something's there. I 100% know something is here in this hallway. I felt it. That's me. So there's no reason to hide from us because you've already let me know that you were here before. You want to try to do a spirit box? I wouldn't listen first. Because mm -hmm. when we were up here before, the first time, mm -hmm. we kept hearing a lot of just noises. It sounded like footsteps. Some just shuffling or moving going mm -hmm. on. I'm going to come down towards you. Are you okay with that? Spirit box. Or not spirit box, music box. We've heard walking around down here since boots stomped on the ground. Was that you? What's your name? Can you touch Steven on the back like you touched me? No. Or touch me again. Were you moving this chair in this room? Were you trying to sit down? That happened 12 years ago, and I remember it like it happened five minutes ago. Can you do that again? If you come over towards this right here and just touch it and make these lights go off for us, you do that. There's one here. One down on more. You touched them for us. It's in this room. It plays with you up here. You make some noises in every room, but what you're in. Hello? Can you light up one of those toys that's on the floor? Give us a sign if you're here. Anything that we have on this hallway floor, just touch it and don't go off for us. All kind of movement. Do you remember Red? We just spoke to him a little bit ago.
Danny Lehman. Is that you walking around these hallways up here? If that's you, give us a sign for us, please. Did they treat you unfairly up here in the infirmary? It's like pipes rattling. Yeah. <laughs> That's her. That's her. Who's saying be shh? Who's saying that? I just heard your voice. Is that you walking around, who? Do you need medical attention? If you need medical attention, set these devices off. Set these ring pods off. Set these cat toys off. Set them off for us. Touch them. So we can give you some help. Set the night before you want. Because you know I won't put this on. Right, it eats your battery. Yeah. Did you just drain Mark's battery in his camera? Oh, that's me. Yeah. Are you trying to gain strength so you can talk to us? They are creepy. Do you want us to leave this hallway and leave you alone? What the hell? Dude, I just heard a response yeah, saying yeah. I said yeah. Who said yeah? No way. That did not just happen. Yeah, it did. I heard it. That's not even a tour. They're not even near us yet. I can wear this room's locked. Do you want us to leave this area up here? It definitely said yeah. Yeah. That room's locked and you can see we're here. Weird. Definitely. I mean, that was clear as day. It said, yeah. It 100% said yes. Yes. Yeah. That is so weird. There's one room that's locked here. That's a treatment room. But you can see it from the back end. Right. You can see in there. Do you want us to come down here in the other room? Is that why you keep making noises down there? I might take my room pod in the other room. Yeah. Just to see. Because there's a bunch of stuff going on down there. there is.
All right, I'm gonna walk down this way real quick. Cause there's a bunch of stuff. This is where I heard the voice saying, yeah. I thought I just asked if he wanted to leave the hallway. I was like, yeah. And this room right here is where we had rock thrown at us. I always got a bad vibe in this room. This room always creeped me out. And like, I just walked through here and I got chills all over my face and my back. I brung a device in this room. You can come touch, it's right in the middle of the floor. It's called a rim pod. You probably used it before. I just heard your voice say, yeah, that you want us to leave here. Why do you want us to leave for? Can you throw the rock at me again? I'm standing here just like last years ago. I asked you the same question if you wanted us to leave or did you want to harm us? And the rock was thrown at me. That's what I asked if you wanted to harm us. Do you still want to harm people up here? Is that you, Mark? What was that? It sounded like boot stomping again. But I personally don't give you permission to harm me if that's what you want to do. You're not allowed to do that. But what you, what you can do for me is go touch that black device in the middle of the floor. You want me to show you how to use it? All you want to do is walk over towards it. Sit. Walk over towards it and just cross the path. That's all you want to do. We only got a little bit of time left to be here. I would like for you to show yourself to us. Give us some kind of sign that you're here. You've already been making noises. You killed Mark's battery and his camera. I'm gonna ask you one more time. Do you want us to leave this area? Do you not like visitors being up here? A lot of outside car noise. All right, I think we're gonna pack it up up here and move on to another part of the jail, the prison.
You all right, Mark? It's more heavier back there than it is in this hallway. I don't know, it just feels heavy in here for me because of what happened. Right, you have an experience. <laughs> that personal experience will always get you. Like when you were in that room down there. Right. Exact same thing. But I know, I heard that, yeah. And I heard them boots walking down and captured that. All right, we're back up here in the infirmary in Knoxville Penitentiary. Right, infirmary hallway. Can we move on somewhere else? Yeah. Okay. Since we really don't want to walk down in here. Gotcha. Trust me, who's here all night? Oh, absolutely, yeah. I'll, I'll just be okay, we'll come back up here. We'll, we'll, we'll make our way back up here again. Danny Lehman, are you up here? You know what I was looking up on my phone? What's that? I thought Red got stabbed here, didn't he? I thought so too. They said he got released. They said he got released and then killed somebody two days later. Huh. I thought he got in the show I side. thought he did too. Or is that somebody else? And we've been here, what? Four, I've been here four times. I swear he was killed. I thought so too. Hmm. I have to look a little more into that. It said he got out and two or three days later killed somebody. So obviously he wasn't very good. <laughs> no. He, he, and you know what? I would listen to that. That goes in the other way. It goes the other way. Wait, I'll talk. I don't have a weird setup for this. So, Got it. The, uh, the music box. It's almost impossible to find a case for this. I was thinking about the uh, defense in the hall. We got some mixed nuts jar. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> hey, do it, man. Where did the lid go? I need the lid. There we go. Yeah, so instead of pushing some stuff down on the lid. Oh, uh, gotcha. Nice. I got that on top. I heard that it works. You got this. Are you still mm -hmm. reporting all yeah. the time? I have to be here for three hours. I got my puny two cat toys here. <laughs> Not 22. <laughs> you throw the chair back in the room? Oh, man. Right here at the scene of the crime. It's crazy to be back here. Bro, I hope at some point you experience something like that. What happened here? Right. So the only time I really got touched was up last year at the Judson house. Yeah. When that thing like pinched my side and the storm grabbed at us. This, this was awesome. It's like Brent got pulled up Molly Star. Yeah, this place. You've been touched there. Like I've only been touched once. Yeah, this place is. And when I didn't grab my ankle in the in the, the room upstairs, you yeah. Judson house. But it sucked because I literally the very first time I came here to investigate. You know what my equipment was? A, a Kodak camera. My 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 uh, piece of equipment was like this cheap ass camera. Right. And a cassette recorder. <laughs> Dude, that's what happened. Cassette recorder. Those things are awesome. Yeah. Yeah, that shows you how long it's been. I'm just gonna leave this roll too. Why not? Anybody hear anything? Or... Oh my god! I got my replies. Yeah, I'm glad we're. Right. Yeah. You want the chair back in? Yeah. Oh, okay. <laughs> I was like, wait, where do you want the chair? Yeah, this, this camera's impossible to do a battery back. I don't know if you want the voice recorder. Oh, okay. I can hold it. That's good. It's I got it. You got a voice recorder on your wrist. Nah. Well, spirits, we are leaving the infirmary. You can all follow us out of this.
Yeah. Because you figure that whole wing where they started, mm -hmm. they're, they're not going to go over there again. Right. So we basically, oh, we can go down to Sugar Shack. That's yeah. Right even better. And that's right by here. I don't know, like I said, I don't know if it's just because of that experience I had up here, but that was definitely something I'll never forget. It, like I said, it happened 12 years ago. I can remember like it was five minutes ago. Right. That's crazy. I think that we've been investigating. I've been investigating that long today. It was nice that we just go free run right from the door. So it's like straight three hours of straight investigating. Right. So I guess what we're doing the private so investigation. Kind of you could go in the daytime. You see how dark it is in here. Mm -hmm. It doesn't matter. Yeah, it's pretty cool. Yeah. 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 Yeah
She did. She just validated nice. it for us. Yeah, I gave him a tutorial on the. Uh... There's gonna be bats in here. Yeah. And it might be a little wet down here. Yeah, this area was like a wreck area for the prisoners, where they were not supervised very much by the prison guards. So needless to say, a lot of hang this stuff happened down here. Oh yeah, I forgot how dark it is in there. And only these walls could tell. I'm sure these walls could have a lot of stories to tell. It has it going full brightness? <laughs> yeah. Well, um, inmates got raped down here if you weren't strong enough. Right. So it's just... This was pretty much the wild, wild west section of the prison right here. Yeah, this is where a lot of bad things happened to a lot of people. You really didn't have guards supervising you. They said pretty mm -hmm. much at all. Yeah, this is free room down here. This is every man for himself. Right. Just, where was the pool tables at? They used to have them down here. Yeah. Um, they, they must have took them out. I'm just trying to find a spot just to set this down and just get like a nice open view video of. Yeah, you know what? In all the times I've been here, usually the sugar shack is very congested with people. People, yeah. When you go to the public stuff. So I really am the best to be down here at all. I don't know why. I'm going to bring our stuff up too. Yeah. We packed very lightly today. Yeah. Just got our basic, yeah. basic stuff. Just pretty much noise makers. Exactly. <laughs> I'm going to set up all my cat toys all around here. That's a real point on it. That was me replaying something. Uh, I have no idea. I didn't even touch a button. Set up over on this side over here. What's that? I got my rent pot set up over here on this table, pretty far away from us, so there's not going to be any accidental activation. over there. Cover, 
You know, so I also never investigated that. What's that? I also never investigated that. No, like you said, it's usually a crowded place with a lot of people. So. Yeah, it's usually really crowded down here. Start out with spare parts. Yeah. Might as well see what we can get. All right, I'm gonna go to our. Are there any inmates here who are out there to talk? Is there any spirits in this place with us that lost their lives to violence because no guards would protect you? What happened down here? Yeah. If you could see us, how many people are down here? Can you give us numbers? Can you say one of our names? Or tell us yours? I'm Steve, and that's what I'm calling the second to be My name is Mark. I came down here a long time ago, about two years ago. Do you remember what happened whenever I was down here? The first time 12 years ago? You like to play tricks on people down here and scare them. Who's the one again? Okay. Who's the one again? Okay, that was you. That's you. That's you. That's you. That's you. That's you. That's you. We have a bunch of devices down on the floor that can talk to us and communicate with us. So if we just turn them on, we have to pay them. So we know that you're down here with us. Did you do some of the paintings on the walls down here? The art looks very nice. Don't be afraid, don't be shy, because we're not here to hurt you. We're not going to anything to sell this back here. We're not dead. Why is it like a walking okay, dog right. or something? You hear it? Brett Snyder, are you down here? Did you used to come down here? Danny Lehman. Are these your paintings on the wall? We saw your paintings up in the infirmary. Did you guys want to play pool down here? Did you pay me? Did you bet on the cereal game? Marty Wall, are you down here? Check 
Party wall, thank you. You can come closer. Hey, hello, can you communicate with your dad? Can you touch the other one on the floor with just like that? And have him do it off the floor? Or do you walk? You can. Thank you. Are you only comfortable with us being this far back from you? That's fine if you are. Do you want us to stay back here or something? Do you like that up? RD Law, is that you? Before we go off in the back, back or you can see a flash. Artie Wall, do you want us to come down to solitary? You do? That's where you will last that in this place. You went down there and you never came back. Is that where you died at in solitary confinement? You died yeah. down there in the hole. In the green garden. Party wall, you can use space for this device here. Can you speak with this? I understand that radio is very new around the time that you have. Do you understand what this device is? If you hear that noise that that device is making, that radio, you can use it to speak to us through. Can you try that for us? Did you just hear a stomping upstairs? I mean, that is the main entrance here. It is. Thank you for activating that again for us. We have more on the floor to look just like that. Can you try to touch them? You can? You want me to show you where they're at so you can come follow me? Okay, if you can see me, we have one right here, right next to it. Just touch it, okay? We have one there. One here. We have them all the way down the hallway. You can follow them all the way down. If you try to do that for me, please, we would appreciate that. Did something happen to you right there? It's like these walls are talking. <laughs> Stories they would tell. Did somebody get murdered down here? Down here? Did they lose their life? If anybody lost their life down here because something happened and you were wrongfully killed, touch these devices and have them go off for us. All of them. Okay, I'm going 
turn this back up. Can you tell us who's there? Who's turning on the cat toy there? Is there anybody other than R.D. Wall down here? Can you say your name for us? Oh, my phone's dead. It's dying. You got your battery pack? Yeah. That's why it looks so dark in here. That, I'm like, why does my phone look so dark? Yeah. Yeah, it's on like maybe 5%. Yeah. We'll get this You are a lifesaver. Oh my god. I told battery packs, we learned those are our godsend. I didn't even prepare on the thing about even charging mine. I'm just wondering what's going on with that ball over there. One capsule and it's the same one. Yeah, no so well. Yeah. Oh no, you're good, you're good. You can come down. No, you're good. Just be careful, watch your step. We got stuff all over the floor. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I mean, it's going off right behind you. You're not even making it go off. Yeah, we're wondering where you guys went. We're like, we want to go both sides. <laughs> <laughs> you, guys, you guys find anything? Yeah, we got all kind of stuff going on. No, I mean, so you guys in the sport, they go up and make a Yeah, they did up here. Well, I just said he was standing up there in the doorway, like, back up there, and he got, like, a seven years to be able to get it. Oh, like, uh, 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 yeah. 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 I was standing right in the doorway, I just, like, this whole side just got, like, a little yeah. bit cold. We were calling some of the names that were tied in with them all. The names were here, and then we kept the way down there from the bottom. We said our team was on. So we um, had our room plug go off in a red cell. Um, we was up in the infirmary hallway. I was like, do you want us to leave? We actually heard a voice joke. Yes. You're like, please. No. No. <laughs> no. Yeah. I would be like, yep, yeah, fine. Did you leave this area because there's new people down here? If not, turn that back on for us down here, please. Can you activate it for us? I know you got them. Oh, yeah. No, 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 you're cool. You can stay down here. I don't care. I mean, you guys been here before? Yeah, yeah. last year was our first. Oh, okay. Definitely a unique place. Got a lot of weird stuff out there. Yeah, I went to the one down in Philly. I did overnight there. Oh, it was in the state. Yeah. <laughs> and then we want to do overnight here. And tomorrow we're going to Trans Allegheny tomorrow. Yeah, see that. See it, and then we just ended up saying something about Crescent, which our friend actually lives down there. Oh, yeah, yeah. Crescent, I've been there, yeah. It's going to be a long over there. All right, so then we got to go back yeah. down there. It's massive. 20 million. Well, these prisons are like this is that's a complex. It's on, it's on like 783. It's like a parallel amusement park. 
Chapel area, building C. Mm -hmm. <sighs> Just insane. Yeah, we've heard a lot of weird stuff. Like, you wouldn't think the chapel that owns this something like maybe like a, it's kind of like chooses to do it there, but it's like a chapel. I don't know. It's, I don't know, it's weird. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that should be before Trans Allegheny, to be honest. Oh, really? Yeah. Shit. We Trans Allegheny is nice to think about. It is nice to think about. Yeah, we're just going to invite you guys on there. Yeah. Yeah. We're just going for that real quick. Right. My favorite part of Trans Allegheny is the work the festival they have down there. <laughs> Just being honest, that's. What is that, Artie Wall? Yeah. Artie Wall, are you still down there? Do you like that up? Or did you move back to Solitary where you, where you perished at? <laughs> the big thing. So that's open then, down there in the Solitary? We're actually doing this on a solitaire. So have you seen any bats down here? No. Yeah. The very first time I came here was looking at her. There was a lady. She said, caution, there may be bats in here. She said one time she was giving a tour, a bat came at her and flew her around. She had to get like all kind of shots and precautionaries. So she had to like, she didn't even want to go down there. She had to just get the tour. <laughs> I would have lost my mind. <laughs> Where are you from? Ridgeway, Pennsylvania. Ridgeway? Yeah, so it's up here in Du Bois. Yeah, I'm on I. Okay. Yep. Uh, we're Brooklyn, you're Brooklyn. Oh. Yeah, we're Brooklyn, Ridgeway. <laughs> yeah, we actually drove down today. We were going to. We didn't know what to do, so we're like, oh, we'll come back down and see. It's a nice little drive. Yeah, that's okay. Paramount weekend. Yeah. Nice. Do you want to Yoga. Congratulations. Here we go to Hillview Manor. Uh, we should have stopped there on his Route 79 in Newcastle. Wait, did we bring the Majestic on the line? No, it was just the Oh, that was a stupid place. Yeah, I'm not lying. That's a good place. What place you The Raven Manor. That's just a Halloween thing. Yeah. yeah. Well, I know a bunch of these places do that stuff. That's why I was thinking of that. Yeah, this is what we, we went to for our wedding anniversary the other weekend. Oh, yeah. Hey, that's not the Hey, it's cool. You know what I mean? Have you ever never been there? Gettysburg is where it's at. Oh, Gettysburg. Mm -hmm. I've been there twice. But that we only did like day like daytime stuff. Like I went during school and then she went. I took her down with me. Mm -hmm. And then we I wanted but actually that's what I was like looking for was paranormal stuff down there. I've been there like 30 times. I hear that it's I mean we, we go every year for Halloween now. I think it's gonna be our last go. Thank you for activating that for us. We have quite a few more on the floor. Can you come touch them all for us? We always say this every time we investigate. We always get activity. When we forget about investigating, we're just mm -hmm. BSing. And that seems chasing the point right there. Are you guys yeah. staying here all night? No, no. no. I go to work in the morning. We we'll, 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 we'll be rolling out of 10 o'clock, so we're here. What do y'all say? Have you guys been building overnight yet? We've done it. We, that was before we had. Yeah, we got there twice every night. Well, I did the tour, but I haven't actually investigated for 10 years. Yeah. Almost did. Yeah, 2016 was my last time here. Oh. We tried to journey all around. You know, I mean, this is the only hour away from Pittsburgh, so I mean, that's where we're from. Pennsylvania is a big area for decent drive for a lot of places. It's yeah. Like this place. There's a um, cool town it's called Waterburg, PA. All right, it's right outside of here, like 15 miles south. All right. Most haunted place I've ever been. One of the most haunted places I've ever been in. They already now we've been dead. Yeah. For some reason, it's not been very long well since then. I mean, literally, it's not built on dead. Like, literally. Can you come touch me? They don't. Built the roads, but won't see the dirt. And they don't let them in on land, it's just the roads. Did you feel anything up in the Avon right when I was here the first time? My sister and mom felt really. Please be careful, we got stuff all over the floor. Hi, Stephen, how are you? No, 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 you're, you're good, you can come down here, you're good. But, yeah, yeah, yeah.
different places I investigated here for the sister and just kept getting weird vibes. Um, yeah. We do. We do. So it doesn't make a huge difference. Yeah. Thank you for turning that back off for us. Would you say that person was Waterford? Waterford. Waterford, yeah, yeah. Yeah. That's fine. I'm going to take a horse off real quick. The only thing I hate about doing this is yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> the worst. It's just expensive too. These are like $200. I know. I mean, I've heard that. They're just insane. Yeah, if you want to check us out, we're on YouTube. So. Okay. For Free Souls Paranormal. We got a lot of stuff from. We're out of Pittsburgh, so we can try to, you know, you have a ride away from Pittsburgh. Even though, you know, yeah, we've been to the Quandrink House. We'll go in in September. Mm-hmm. I've never been there. I saw that. So, yeah. Was it really pretty cheap? No, no obvious. We spare boxes up. Uh, we do that. We didn't bring a lot of equipment with us. We yeah, only a couple hours. You know what I'm saying? Are you guys staying for the next group? No. no. We're just doing the. Uh, well, we're still down. We've, we've been here several times. We, we and Benjamin have never actually investigated together here. And, uh, oh. I've been here 10 years, so it's been a while. Yeah, last time I was here was 2016 for my birthday. <laughs> Yeah, <laughs> 16. But this place, I mean, have you guys experienced anything up here yet? No, we just started walking around. <laughs> and I heard there's no stores or anything like that. I went upstairs in the back, I mean, she waited behind her or something. I was just about to say it because I've, I've noticed from investigating here, I've investigated my sister and niece before. Sometimes we would go throughout the building, the men would feel nothing, and something would be. It was only a five or two of that was yeah. in the back. So keep an eye out for that. I just saw this on Ghost Adventures. Yeah. We had um, <laughs> we had our red paws going off in a red cell. Oh yeah. Um, we was up in the infirmary area. Um, we heard like somebody just like stomping around the hallways. Um, Tonight. Yeah. And then um, and then I was like, if you want us to leave, give us a sign. We heard, yes. Literally, a voice said yes. It is definitely captured. That's cool. I'm sorry, we didn't mean to. Oh no, 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 no. We're yeah, we're all here for the same thing, and um, we're just trying to get as much in as possible. You know what I'm saying? Just trying to get it all in because you're only here for three hours. This would be one long three-hour video on YouTube. People are gonna be pissed at me. (laughs) (laughs) Uh, We're so backlogged on videos. I mean, we're backlogged from last year. Yeah, exactly.
too. I mean, we at one point we had like 25, 128 gigabyte SD cards full of footage. And just so much when you work a full time job and you just can't get to it. This place is, I love Moundsville though. This is, this is one of my favorites. It's been a long time since we've been here. Yeah. All right, well, have fun, guys. All right, have a good night. Yeah, good activity. Trying to figure out how to get out of here. Yeah, it's just up the steps. And yeah. Thank you for this battery pack. It's a lifesaver because we'd be done. I'd be going home. I like always that one. Oh, it's going to get dark. You know what I did? I left my damn true bottle up in the infirmary. Oh, did you? Yep, it's in it's <laughs> Trigger all good. Which which way is the um solitary you got? Six solitary you only go outside. I'm so yeah, you gotta go outside. I'm a ding dong. I can't remember anything. Yeah, the last time I was here, sometimes whenever it rains a lot, they, yeah. they close the sugar shack. Right. So I'm glad it's uh, open. Sometimes it gets so wet down here, you just get shut down. Which way do we go? We got it this way, right? Yeah. Scared the crap out of me. Oh, now I gotta go to J Block, dude. I gotta go there. Had one of the most crazy experiences down there on J Block. We was up on the second tier in the cell block and right in front of the ability kid cell. And um this voice was just like I was like, what the? <laughs> it was so creepy. <laughs> Shadow Man Hallway, right back at it. Look, for being the sunlight, look at this, dude. Look, you can't even see it all the way down the hallway, how dark it is. I'm already on like two hours of footage. Do you remember my flashlight I had? Yeah. Gone. Don't know really? where it's at. Yeah. My so my Sony voice recorder gone. Don't know where it's at. Still mad about my headlamp crescent. Oh yeah, your headlamp crescent. You dropped it and it just shattered. Oh, that's how they don't like. Yeah, no, I don't like that room. Mm -mm. No. Yeah, long time ago. Just bad news in there. Mm -mm, I won't go back in there. Yep. There's a really old cemetery where we're by where we're located. We don't go up there. And the one way it was super, super hot. Like we go out there? Is there a way up there? Yeah, we gotta go out. Yeah, we gotta go out to the cafeteria. Yeah, cemeteries are creepy. Yeah. Yeah, it's um, speaking of, have you guys ever been to the, do you know there's a uh, prisoner cemetery out in the, about a four mile drive from here? We've heard about it. White Gate it's Cemetery? Oh, yeah, then we looked for it. Yeah, we're going to find it. Yeah, White Gate Cemetery. Yeah, it's not really far from here. Place it is. Yeah, we almost passed it up. We had a picture. Brendan was like pointing, and they took a picture, and you can see like someone in like the wood line of the cemetery and stuff. What time is it? You know what time it is? Uh, I'm looking at my watching this really quick. Oh yeah, this is solitary. Yeah, right down these oh, steps. Go down the... And there's a bat cave. Yeah. Alfred did a bat cave. Feels good in here because I got my hoodie on like a ding dong. Yeah, no lights would be down here. Wraps all over the place and stuff. Yeah, I'm standing on the right there and I just, I really like this whole sign. It's not cool enough on over here. Yeah. 
Or is it back in here? Yep, it's back here in that corner back here. Oh, nice. At least I got somewhere I can set my phone down at and record. Yeah, right back in the corner Super awesome people. Well, they actually don't be touched for them to go off. Did you like being down here in the dark? Did this drive you crazy? You had no light? I know it would drive me crazy. Down here by yourself? Hardy Wall, are you down here with us? So, can you make one of those devices go off? Or is it somebody else besides RD Wall? The person that killed RD Wall, are you down here? Do you remember killing him? In that corner. Dude, I can't even imagine spending time down here. It's so quiet. These are nuts. We've been there 60 seconds and we leave. <laughs> It is so dark down here. Mm -hmm. I would, like you said, I would yeah, lose my you, mind. You, you, have you lost your mind already down here? It took me like that whole time to see the door in front of me. Yeah. Imagine a weather pitch black. Right. Shit crawling all over here. Exactly, yeah. Uh, you remember having to be able to come so quick. Is there anything you want to tell us? We're going to bring it to the storybooks?
Where was that on? Xbox. You had people from the Oil City Paranormal Society, and they said they had like a couple of buildings out in Brookville that they always investigate. Yeah, Brooklyn old. Yeah. Oh, definitely don't get any stations down here. No, definitely not. Down here. In two down here. Anybody down here with us? Anything you'd like to say to us while we're down here? We don't have much time, but... Name. Name. My name's Mark. Steven. Allison. Can you tell us your name? I said something like immediately after that. Can, can you try to repeat your name a little slower for us so we can understand? Are you alright with us being down here? Or do you want us to leave? How many days were you stuck down here in solitary confinement? What did you do to get put in solitary confinement? Can you say that again? I don't get say enough or something like that. Are you angry that we're down here? If something bad happened to you down here. How did the guards treat you down here? Did you get fed? R.D. Wall, are you still down here? What happened inside of here? That'd be a good little way to die. Is this where you die? You can see your brother die. Who killed you here, R.D. Wall? Why did they kill you? Did you owe people money in jail? Did you snitch on somebody for doing something bad? Were you a snitch?
Were you, be, were you able to protect yourself before you died? Or was it a sneak attack? Was it more than one person who attacked you? How did they kill you? Were you stabbed or beaten to death? We're just here to communicate. We're not here to judge you. We understand that prisoners were sent here because they were convicted. And we're just here to talk to you. Man to man. What was the crime that you committed to get put in prison? Did you kill somebody to get put in there? Yeah. What? Did you kill somebody or do you fall? Can you imagine that I'm back here where you died? Where you were stabbed? Did it hurt? Or did it happen quickly? Is there anything you'd like to tell us before we leave here? Were you innocent? Were you innocent? Wrongfully accused of a crime that you didn't commit? Yeah. It said yes? Why do you expect us to believe you? You were found guilty. What year did this crime happen? Is this where you died here? Where you bled out? Did they find your body right away after you passed away? Or did you lay here for a couple of days? What was that? Did you hear that? Yeah, I don't know what it said. Did you just laugh? No. I just heard a laugh come from me. A real creepy laugh. What am I Nobody laughed? Nobody laughed. No. Was it through the spirit box? It came through the spirit box. I definitely have it on my body camera right now. Did I just hear you laugh? Are we off base with our claims about you?
Is this party one that we're talking to? Or is this the prisoner who killed him? Are you happy about what you did? Did Arnie Wall deserve to die? Is there anything else you want to go see? Because it's four after nine. What did Arnie Wall do to make you so mad, so enraged? Then you killed him. Or you want to go somewhere else? It's quarter after nine. Yeah. Okay. All right, sweetheart, thank you. All right, no All right. problem. You have a good night. Happy, 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 yeah, happy anniversary. Have fun at uh, your other your paranormal weekend. <laughs> Sounds like an awesome adventure. Did you know that's the first I've ever investigated back here? I think never investigated back here. You would never? No. Every time I come here, I wanted to go in there and investigate, but mm -hmm. got sidetracked with other stuff. Right. You guys have a Usually we have a infirmary gas right here. Oh, there you go. Oh. You back? Yeah. Well, that that weird, dude. It's like, like gave out. It's not a pain, is it? No. It's like that. That was weird. Yeah. It's like. Yeah. You see me? I was just yeah. like, ugh. It's on my camera right here, bro. That was weird. Oh, it hurts. Did you attack Steven? I don't know the realm of possibility down here. Or anywhere in this place. Dude, that was so weird. Dude. I was just like, ugh. Yeah, dude. That was like, weird. What the hell just happened? <laughs> I have no idea. I was like, on my back. And it just like buckled me. What was that? That didn't make any sense. Dude, I have no idea what just happened, but that was crazy. That was crazy. I mean, I I don't know. It was it, it hurt right here, like right here. That was weird. No, I saw you, and I'm like, what the hell? Yeah. Is that all I brought out? Was that? Yeah, because my red was in there. Yeah. What was that all about? Never moves like that. No. It's like I got like punched in my back or something. It was weird. I'm not making that up. That was just a no, weird. No, no, yeah. That was just a weird thing that yeah, happened. Yeah, I got it. Yeah, let's get let's make some uh... let's go to J Block. Yeah. We gotta go up there, dude. Second tier. <laughs> yeah, that was weird that I got punched in my back. Yeah. What the hell? Like, no joke. I never experienced anything like that. I was just like this, like, mm. We didn't go in that way? No, we didn't go in that way. Oh, uh, it's, it's quarter after nine. No, no, we went up this way. I think you can go in that way. It's quarter after nine. Yeah. Nine plus. Right? Nine plus. Especially these bigger, we're used to long way investigations. Oh, we gotta get back here. Oh, the cafeteria. Right. Yeah. It's just it's so massive. You just want to be everywhere at once. Yeah. Like it's impossible to investigate everything everywhere. Right. Right. Dude, this has been awesome though. It's gonna be a good video. Yeah. Straight three hours. I mean, it's gonna be a three-hour premiere. Like no joke, it is. So I want to hear the playback of the spare boxes. Right. I'm not even going to review any of this footage. Just I'm just playing the right. I'm just exactly. going to make the foot, make the video and right. set it out there. Yep. 
I still don't know what just happened to me down here. I know. That was so crazy, dude. Very strange. It literally felt like I almost got shanked or something, dude. It was just weird. No, that's what I was like, insinuating. I was like, it feel like something. I wonder if that's how he died. Maybe he got stabbed in the back. Okay. I'll try to pass that up. Right. Dude, that's like one of the most haunted places I've ever been. Okay, Jake Block's gonna be down this side. Look how dark that is down there. It's like looking into the abyss. That's just madness. Oh yeah. Dude, okay, J Block. J and K Block. J and K Block. We going through this way, right? Yeah. Yeah. I'm just trying to think of which side we was on. No, we was on this side over here. Yeah, see, I remember the speakers. We got to go up these steps right here and down the range on that side. Yeah. Yeah, it, it literally smells like bodies in here, like like just like sweaty bodies. It does. Yep, this is. Yeah, this was it right here, I think. Oh, you can't even get on them. Oh, seriously. They're in that bad of shape now. Let's go one more. Yeah, they're all. Yep, yeah, they're all locked up. Fudge. Wait, this is open. Yeah. Yeah, this was definitely this. Definitely the spot where we heard that voice right here. Because there's a cell right on the top. Yeah. It says Billy the Kid. Really? Or no, it's the top one. It's, a, it's the top one. It's yep, this side must be that bad then. Oh, yeah, look. Yeah, that's like, yeah. Oh, that hurts my soul. No, it does, but it's chained up down there. We're on the... The fourth tail of the fourth tear of um. Oh yeah, people were definitely thrown off this block. Yeah, I'm curious to see what we played out in the we heard. Right. Because my uncle spent. Yes, he's chained up too. Yeah, my uncle spent 12 years, was, that was his longest day, 12 years in uh, the hell? maximum security prison. Oh, shit, just dropped right on me. Like paint chips just fell on me. And my uncle spent 12 years in his maximum security prison. Yeah. Using like eleven words. Mm-hmm. Uh, Is there any prisoners still roaming these blocks up here? He said when he got out, like there were times where he would just, as strange as it sounds, just love to hear nothing, just quiet, because he said it was so loud. I swear to God, this door was locked. I swear to God, dude. I don't know. No, this one, right across this way. 
He said the prison's constant yelling. He was just tired of hearing all the inmates yelling. Let me look for Billy to get up here. I'm trying to. Right. I wish I had the video footage from that. Oh, I wish I had the video footage. Yeah, this is where the showers is at. You had no, you had no privacy. You just showered with the dude right next to you. You want to head back down? Yeah. We'll figure somewhere else to go to. You want to go, just go back? I'm sorry. Oh, no, you're good. That's crazy to think in Mansfield there's like a, a six tier one. Yeah, there's six so tiers. It's like double this? Yeah. Almost double this. This is four or three. Uh, I think this is. This is four. <clears throat> No, it has to be the one down. Is this the way we came? Down these steps? Yeah. Okay. I just can't remember. We were down on that side. Yeah. And this open area here is just like a yeah, guard but, area, I think, that was here. Yeah, there's a guard area. There's a or it's a Sally Port. Something like that, yeah. But definitely a Sally Port. Yeah. No, it, nope. It was this one because I remember the Cincinnati Bank. Yep, it was this. It was this cell block right here. It was this range. Because I remember this painting. Yeah. Me and Frank, we were sitting around the other side of that wall. We heard, Arr. just like heard it, dude. This is in West Virginia. You're off that cable and you're playing. <laughs> okay. Because they use these speakers for the haunted house. Yeah. Any prisoners still roaming these blocks? Oh, I see why I shut down because look. They still keep stuff up for that. Yeah, house. for a haunted house. Yeah. You had a big gas chamber right there. Can you bang like this? Knock back to me? Who was Billy the Kid Cell? We're, we heard his voice. Can you make that growl for us again? That's how dark the range is at night. Obviously, the neon lights weren't out there. Right. Wow. Can you make a noise for us? Slam one of your cell doors. If you were innocent and wrongfully accused, can you make a noise? We're trying to let your voice be heard. I guess they were all guilty. Was 
it. We got to do it, yeah. 928. We got a half hour left. We got to get back here for a uh, full investigation of this. Right. We came this way, right? Tell you what. Yeah, the group that's with us is very, very small. Very respectable. Right. I haven't heard anybody. Everybody's like, oh, I'm sorry. You're all, you know, right. Just barging on you. Very apologetic. They're about as good as we could have anticipated, really. As good as we could ask for, really. Come here. Yeah, for sure. You just want to go back to the cafeteria and finish it up? Oh, we can go back up to the infirmary. Whatever you want to do, Mark. This is your night. No, you don't want to leave. You can follow us around the prison if you want to come with us. You just can't follow us home. And if you follow us home, well, we get in trouble for taking prisoners home with us. And we don't end up right back in here. I've always loved the cafeteria. Like that place. I mean, it's we got a half hour left. Might as well just finish it up down here on the first floor. You happy we came? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Like I said, we didn't know what to expect how many people were going to be here. Right. You know, we've seen what? Like, a handful of people the whole time. But this is pretty big to disperse a group of about 20 people. Yeah, if that. It wasn't very big. Or you want to do something down here in the shadow man's hallway? Cafeteria. Although, you know what? If I came back here again, mm -hmm. I would definitely bring all of them. What was that? Hello? There's got to be somebody down in the cafeteria. Hello? It's not like it came from. Yeah. It, you know what? No, it's luring you to that place you don't want to go. Oh, yeah. It's trying to lure you to that place you don't want to go. Yeah, I'm not going to that room. No. Yes, it is. No, I came from down there. Somebody just said hello. Hello? All right, we're recording again. That's part of the session down here in the cafeteria at Loungeville Penitentiary. <laughs> we told you we'd be back. We're here to pour them for the blood of the country of the West. We only got a few minutes left to speak to you. We just got to give us the information that we need. Last time we were here a couple hours ago, we got a name Mike. Is Mike still here? Mike is here. Make yourself known to us. Is there somebody else here besides Mike? Can you know what's your name? Did you appreciate having visitors here today from Sweet City and Sweetie? What happened down in Solitaire? What happened to Steven? Did something affect him down there? 
Is that paranormal? What's very weird? I was just back to see about it. Yeah, obviously, it's like. Yeah. It's weird, it's very strange. Is that how you killed that guy down on the call there? You stabbed him in the back? Did you sneak attack him? Is that what happened to R.D. Wall down there, where he was killed? Oh, very strange. It's weird, dude. Yeah. So weird. Like, that never ever happened to me. Like, I don't even know what that meant. Was that R.D. Wall killing how he was killed? Was that something trying to attack Steven? Right in the lower back, like a kidney shot. Get over it. The more I think about it, the more it makes no sense. Can't run my head around it. You know, I did that to Stephen down. You know, I can't run my head around. I gotta go work on one. In a few hours. We appreciate your hospitality atmosphere. We know you like the rough and rugged, like you got to be a badass and defend yourself, but we're not going to do We come here with respect to talk to you. We're not here to harm you, fight you, kill you. Are you okay that we came down here to visit you? Is there anything else you want to tell us before we leave here? Bye. Did you hear that? It was like, bye. Do you want us to leave? Are you glad we're leaving soon? Mine. <laughs> I wonder if that's the same. Are you the same spirit that I recorded in the hallway? You got an EVP in the hallway. You get exactly what it says. Some smart ass comment. Yeah, that's kind of funny actually. Oh, it said, is that so? Brian and I were talking in the hallway there, and we heard a voice clear, clear as me and him saying, is that so? Are you being a smart ass for us? I mean, we're fine with that. We're kind of... It is what it is. But you're not going to harm me. Right. Yeah, we get to get in our cars and drive home. You gotta stay here. Yeah, this is where you live. This is, this is where you're stuck at for the rest of your exi existence in the spirit. Do you have any messages for us? Or anybody else? This is us giving you a voice. Are you okay that we came back here? What's up? What? Who is that? No. No, it's you. Oh, baby. I just felt. 
on the spiritual. Were you trying to pull this out of the pain? You want to try to you, you want to try to sell this video for food? Are you a prankster down? I feel like it's just something that likes to mess with you. Come on, cut it off. I've never, and we cut it off. Dude, it sounded like there was like metal being drunk in this room. There was a woman that came and said, I never, and I cut her off. Oh, my bad. No, 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 no. It's just... That's Hello? Yeah. 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 All right, I'm going to leave it down. Let's hear silence for... You know when you sound like you drag metal across the middle yeah. concrete floor? Yeah. That's what it sounded like in there. Like one of those stoves or whatever was being moved. Dude, that made no sense. I'm sitting here holding this and it felt like something was just wiggling on, pulling on the end of this. I thought you was looking at my legs. I'm like, dude, nah, I know I'm white. It's like, damn, dude. Like, like, you're going to make me feel self conscious. We're going to pack it up a leaf and you tell us goodbye. Now I shut this off and there was a lady that said, I never, and I cut you off. What were you going to say? I'm sorry I cut you off. He does. He does. He does. What does he do? It's weird, isn't it? What's that? He does what? <laughs> Who is he? What's his name? Is he a bully? Is he that scream? Did we just hear you scream? You ready for us to put these lights off and leave? Yeah. I think it's weird you said about back in there. Did something happen back there in the kitchen? I remember hearing a story before. I'm not sure if it was true or urban legend. The during the riot, somebody got cooked back in the kitchen, thrown into a pot. Is that true? Yes or no? It'd be a hell of a way to die. Getting boiled to death. Did that happen here? Your daughter. This is who? Like this is, but then it cut off. Is this then? Go back in there. 
Who is this? And the other one. And A couple more minutes left for us. Something bad happened here in the cafeteria. We're back in the kitchen. I feel like a lot of stuff has probably happened in the inconspicuous area here. They weren't getting lost. Did something bad happen here during the riot? I mean, they just let prisoners into each tier. They're all in here. So, I mean, if, you, if somebody was in K and J and they had beef, they're, they're down here getting on. Yeah. That's it. They're down here fighting with four of each other. Yeah. How many people actually died in this prison? There were a lot. How many guards died in this prison? Did anybody you know, a friend that you had here, did they die here? Why do you want us to leave? Are we invading your space? That is clear to me. I'm kind of pissed off too. Why? Well, it? it sounded kind of pissed mm -hmm. off. Please. What's going to happen if we don't leave? Your request? Request what? Request for us to be removed? This is strange. This is strange. This is strange. Are you just figuring this out? How to talk through this? We're giving you a voice. You can leave again. This is how you can talk to us. But yes, we agree it's strange. The light is strange. Are you still here living within these walls? Are you still serving your sentence? What are the life sentence that you have to serve? Did you rape a woman? Did you put in here? Did you hurt any women? Did you hurt any kids? Did you hurt your own family? house. Did you burn the house down? Was there people in the house that you could have burnt down? Is that what you did?
Is this cafeteria your house? Is this is this where you roam? Are you the boss of this place? Harry Powers, are you here? Harry Powers, do you know you're a scumbag? What you did to those women was uncalled for. You deserved everything you got here. And then some. I'm drawing a blank on his name. I think it is. Don't have to see his husband. Oh, yeah. He's here as well. Right. He's by a coat. Is the, hu is the husband of Zona Hester Shoe here? We went to go see your wife at her grave. She spoke to us. And that's how she told her mom, and that's how you got caught. You thought you got away with it. You didn't let anybody near her body after you killed her until she was buried. Oh, sorry, and I see. And you see what? What was that? Did you have my voice? Yeah, it was super loud. It was like something yelled behind me. Yeah. yeah. Who was that? Johnny, did you just yell at me? That was definitely captured. Yeah, oh yeah. That was loud. Johnny, what's your last name? Bring it back up. Yeah, we gotta respect the rules. Yeah. Alright, we're respecting the rules and we are going to wind up the investigation now. Thank you for communicating with us. We appreciate it. I'm glad that we're all leaving. Let's set the beat. One Twice. thing one thing you cannot do, you cannot follow the phone, attach yourself to us, our equipment, our car, you gotta stay here. This is your spot. This is where you live. Hey, thank you.